As I, said, as I said in the unheard recording, that sound hits hard. YouTube, do not even talk about today's stream. Do not acknowledge that the last two hours happened. Well, hour and, hour and a half, maybe. But hopefully this works. Those of you on stream will have to rewatch those cutscenes, but it'll be fine, I'm sure. They're great cutscenes. There's worse cutscenes to rewatch, trust me. I know there's no audio right now. I'll fix that. Boom, audio. Cain is deified. The clans tell tales of him. Few know the truth. He was mortal once, as were we all. However, his contempt for humanity drove him to create me and my brethren. I am Razio, firstborn of his lieutenants. I stood with Cain and my brethren at the dawn of the Empire. I have served him a millennium. Over time, we became less human and more... divine. Cain would enter the state of change and emerge with a new gift. Some years after the Master, our evolution would follow. Until I had the honor of surpassing my lord. only one possible outcome, my eternal damnation. I, Razio, was to suffer the fate of traitors and weaklings, to burn forever in the bowels of the Lake of the Dead. Cast him in. Burning with white hot fire, I plunged into the depths of the abyss. Unspeakable pain, relentless agony. Time ceased to exist. Only this torture and a deepening hatred of the hypocrisy that damned me to this hell. An eternity passed, and my torment receded bringing me back from the precipice of madness. The descent had destroyed me, and yet I lived. Thank you all for being here after the hour and a half of technical difficulties. I really appreciate it and hope that you're all doing well. I know you, Razier. You are worthy. What madness is this? What pitiful form is this that I have come to inhabit? Death would be a release next to this travesty. You did not survive the Abyss, Razier. 
I have only spared you from total dissolution. I would choose oblivion over this existence. The choice is not yours. I am destroyed. You are reborn. The birth of one of Cain's abominations traps the essence of life. It is this soul that animates the corpse you lived in. And that, Raziel, is the demise of Nazgoth. There is no balance. The souls of the dead remain trapped. I cannot spin them in the wheel of fate. They cannot complete their destinies. Redeem yourself. Or if you prefer, avenge yourself. Settle your dispute with Cain. Destroy him and your brethren. Free their souls and let the wheel of fate churn again. Use your hatred to reave their souls. I can make it possible. Become my soul reaver. My angel of death. Okay, let's get on with this. Uh, for the... Second time today. Just in case. Nothing should happen, but in case it does. I uh, I also completely forgot that the, the US versions of games run at 60 FPS, and uh, not 50 on PS1. These so gates that. twist space. Laying a path across great spans. Yes, but until I know what each room, where each one is, it doesn't seem much point taking. It doesn't seem much point taking it. Definitely seems faster to jump. You are weak. You must feed. The old hunger has left me. I have no desire for blood. You are changed. Your bloodthirst is replaced by a deeper need. You have become a devourer of souls. To sustain your strength, you must hunt the lost spirits of the underworld and consume the souls of your enemies. So it turns out the issue was, as uh, Lima106 uh, said, the PAL version. Uh, the, for some reason, the NTSC version of the game doesn't have anti-piracy protection. Uh, the PAL version does. So if you're emulating, like I do, like I am, because I have no other choice, uh, it breaks. And I'm going for the PS... One second. Your wings, though ruined, are not without purpose. Take hold of them as you leap, and they will carry you across this chasm. Go for the PS1 version, because I have a PlayStation controller, not a Dreamcast controller. Uh, there is an HD remaster for the, for the Dreamcast ROM. Looks pretty cool. What scabrous wretches are these? Stua, the scavengers of the underworld. Their feral hunger has claimed countless souls, spirits who now shall never find their rest. That's a face only a mother could love. Like mine. Oh, okay, cool, rad, I suppose. Game came out in the 90s, I'm allowed to say rad. It's tubular, in fact. Uh, how do I... 
How do I leave this room? I figured it out. These portals are your conduit between the spectral and material realms. With their aid, you may gather matter and will yourself to become manifest in the physical world. This is taxing, however. Your strength must first be fully restored. You require no conduit to return to this plane. You may abandon your physical body at any time. So I'm pretty sure that's the uh, the main gimmick of the game. Sustain your strength to prolong your manifestation in the physical world. If you fail to feed or absorb too many wounds, this fragile matter will dissolve. Cool. I guess this way. Don't take too much damage, you go back to the spirit world. Or not. That is a gate. I didn't know if it would open automatically. I guess it doesn't. Back into the temple. But it's different this time. You are young yet, Raziel. You still retain many of your vampiric weaknesses. Immersion in water, while not fatal, will dissolve your physical body, forcing your return to the spirit world. Checks out. Be aware that in the spectral realm, water has neither heft nor lift. It stands as thin as air. Dang, I put my foot in. That did a lot of damage. Please? Thank you. What are these creatures? Do you not recognize them? They are the children of your brother, Duma. That's impossible. These foul, scuttling beasts could not be kin of our high blood? Do you suppose that time stood still for you, Raziel? Much has changed since you passed from the world of men. They have evolved. I knew my opponent's weaknesses, having suffered them myself. Physical wounds are fleeting. A vampire's immortal flesh begins to close as soon as it is cleaved. Vampires need only fear those wounds that impale or inflame. Water scorches like acid, and fledglings are devastated by sunlight's touch. Would have to modify my tactics to suit my foes. I guess just knock them backwards into things. Oh, hey. Hey, you like spikes, I hear. The, uh, the whole triangle is going to get old. Oh, I freaking did it again. Right, hold it. And then let go. Unfettered from the flesh, a creature's soul fades swiftly into the spectral realm. Draw it in quickly, Raziel, or you will be compelled to follow. That was really quiet, apart from the uh, voiceover. 
I'll, uh, I'll fix that chat. When I get a moment. I'm just gonna throw this person in for- this, this vampire into a bath. You can do it, Sol. You can do it! You can- I believe in you! It's trying so hard. There we go. Put everything to full. See how that works. Save again! So the, um, the commonly accepted wisdom for why the Steam and GOG versions of this game were pulled uh, is that the video codec, the Bink video codec uh, license ran out. Your physical prowess surpasses what you knew in life. Even massive obstacles can be moved effortlessly. Because you're dead. You don't care. The what? Uh... It's related to the video files, babe. Basically, the, there's there's an encoder license to use it, and the license was uh, expired, or is held by someone else now. And um, that's why they're not on there because the cutscenes technically can't be played because of the because of the codec that pat that's behind the cutscene. It's not even the cutscene material itself; it's the tech that runs it or loads it, I suppose, from memory. At least that's my understanding of codex and encoders. My God! Oh. The sanctuary of the clans reduced to ruin. Beyond these walls lay the pillars of Nosgoth, the seat of Cain's empire. How humble it now appeared, collapsing into the dust of its former magnificence. And yet, I had only just emerged. In the instant between my execution and resurrection, Centuries had apparently passed. This world is wrecked with cataclysms. The Earth strains to shrug off the pestilence of Cain's parasitic empire. The fate of this world was preordained in an instant by a solitary man. Unwilling to martyr himself to restore Nosgoth's balance, Cain condemned the world to the decay you see. In that moment, the unraveling began. Now, it is nearly played out. Nosgoth teeters on the brink of collapse. Its fragile balance cannot hold. Probably do something about that, then. <laughs> God damn it, Kane. Yep. Kane is why we can't have nice things. I don't know. I guess the fire? But there you go. Conquest ending is the canon ending of Blood Omen. Oh, there's a little fire dance. Heck yeah, do a fire dance. In the immortal words of Shang Tsung, your soul is mine. Can I pick up weapons? Oh, yes, I can. Hey. Oh. Okay, that works. That's 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 pretty effective. Anyway, uh, can I go through this door? No. Can I pick this up again? Telekinetically, yes. No, oh, he heard me. 
Gonna raise the audio. I think the like voiceover is separate to the speech slider. Also, I think my other PlayStation controller is balked. Luckily, I have this other one. Funky door. Guess I can't open it. Okay, so you can technically do the impale attack at any point, it's just easier when they're uh, stunned, for obvious reasons. P please, I wish to pick it, thank you. Hey, this is where I got yeeted in. This, at least, had remained constant. The endlessly swirling vortex of the abyss. My tomb and the womb of my rebirth. Though much of Nosgoth's landscape had changed, these cliffs gave me my bearings. My clan territory was to the west. I was anxious to see how my descendants had fared during the centuries of my absence. Oh, cool, you, you can just hold weapons while gliding. That's good to know. I thought I would drop it, that's why I wasn't gliding. That might be might be a bit faster than um, just running and jumping. That's way out there, and that's just a wall. That music though. I'll be with you in a moment, sir. Ah, no, 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 no. Thank you very much. Okay, I can't get that yet because I can't get through the, the grill. Utter desolation. My once proud kin wiped from this world like excrement from a boot. I knew the hand that wrought this deed. So I do know from research, I guess this was before this recording started, um, I do have a guide up for how to get all of the health upgrades and stuff, uh, so we'll be, I'll be ignoring those when I see them. Because I know when I can go back to get them. Oh, hey, you didn't die. That's awkward. Too close. 
Right, you. That remains in you. Get away. Remember the dodge exists. Probably do the fight up here by the actual fire. There's a thought for you. Maybe I can't throw them onto the torches. Maybe it has to be this fire up here. soul back and then I'll go and deal with the one that's currently paralyzed if I have to. Uh, could do with the health. Excuse me, were you not listening when I said I could do with the health? It's actually died that time as well. Ooh. I should probably probably have snuck. Okay, so I, I think it's if you don't that's water, that's bad. If you don't take the soul, they don't disappear. Which makes sense, you know. They need a soul to live, I suppose. I'll allow them that much. Please, Raziel, thank you. I feel like a lot of this game is going to be, please pick up the thing, Raziel. Well, that person's in two pieces. I don't think they're going to get better. Just a, just a hunch. Really? Ha! Stealth impale. I'll take this one off. Just gonna go up. There's usually good stuff up, and I don't need to fire things because I don't need health. Okay, that one made me jump. I'll be honest. You're standing on it. I wish to pick up the pointy stick. Flip the lead. Pull the lever, Raziel. Is that the right level? Seems to be. Oh, dear. Control is going to take some getting used to, I feel. Do anything. Alright enough. It's gonna go 
out of this door. How does that sound? Does that sound good to everyone? As you can't actually stop me, it has to. Fantastic as a vampire. No! Please! I didn't recognize these flayed racks of flesh. Their scent was vampiric. They gnawed upon their victim's carcass like dogs. Well, they're going to have to die. the little fire dance they do. It makes me happy. Oh, do I go there? Oh, no, that's where I came This charnel house bore the unmistakable marks of Melchiah's clan. To what depths had our dynasty plummeted if these ghouls were the descendants of my high-born brother? Were they so debased as to recruit fledglings from the desiccated corpses here interred? Yeah, that would be awful, wouldn't it? No vampire's ever done that in the history of vampire kind. just to try to attack me? Yeah, I need to push this. Okay. It's in the box. I don't think that's right. For some reason. So do I go and try and find my uh, my pointy stick? I got yeasted in this direction. I'm sure I'll find another one. I like how he doesn't really grab it so much as just shove his claw his fingers into the box. Up. A very satisfying high jump, I will admit. My brother Melchiah was made last, and therefore received the poorest portion of Cain's gift. Although immortal, his soul could not sustain the flesh which retained much of its previous human frailty. This weakness, it seemed, was passed on to his offspring. Their fragile skins barely contained the underlying decay. Oh, don't walk in that. Hmm. I'm just going to assume this is the door I want. G game. Game. Oh god, Sparrow Staircase. Oh, that was horrible. Please tell me there aren't too many of those in the game. Oh, yeah, what point? Oh, 
No, that's where I came from. Okay. Good to know that that's there. It's been a while since I saved. Let's save again. Uh, I'm also going to temporarily mute the mic and close my webcam while I keep playing. Uh, I'd never had my snack during my wellness break because I didn't have the wellness break because I was fixing the tech. So uh, just give me one second. Okay, I'm back. Cool, cool. Where am I? Where am I even taking this? Because I can't, presumably, can't get it out of this area. It's a cool idea. I think I landed in the water. That sounded like it just died. It's a cool idea for a combat system. I'm just not sure I'm a fan of it. There we go. Okay, well that soul's gone. I also don't know where to put this. I'm guessing over here. Uh, no, I'm probably gonna die. Hey chat, how you doing? Let's go on this journey together, shall we? I can't get that high. Okay, well that was wasted. That was a waste of time and health. I pressed jump, in case you were curious. Uh, as you can tell, it, it didn't particularly work. Where are you running off to? Get back here. Nah, that's what I thought. Punk. Okay, well that was an experience. Maybe I was supposed to die and come down here to progress. Consume both of you. 
too many times to think. Come over here yet? Or do I need I hate the fact that I can't like look around properly. Oh, there you go. Because I can't climb this, and I'm pretty sure climbing is probably an ability. He's room to a meeting now, I hope the rest of the stream goes well. Thanks, babe. I'm gonna have to do all this later. There we go. It is not that way yet. I'm hoping the rest of the stream goes well too. Hopefully everyone watching is, in, is enjoying. If you were here earlier again, sorry for the technical problems. And if you weren't here earlier, what technical problems? I just started the stream two hours late for no good reason. The same issue of uh, I had with Banjo Tooie. Is this just the door I don't know how to open yet, or a door I can't get, or like I need an ability later to do something with this area? There we go. Right, let's try the uh, let's try the jump over the water again, shall we? to this one. Nope, get out. Get out of the water. Water bad. Sneaking. It didn't work. Oh, I guess it did because that one didn't see me. Uh, yeah, I've got nothing. I'm just gonna leave. Going down. I'm impressed about the lack of loading screens. I will admit. Is this something I just pull up? No. No, it is not. Uh, oh, it's up there. Can I get up there? I do anything with this in any way, shape, or form. No. Oh, I'm just standing on platforms because they're higher. Uh, I know there's the thing on the floor over there, which I guess is a vampire. Do I have to kill that? It's not getting up for me to kill it, so who knows? Maybe I wasn't supposed to go this way yet. Yeah. 
Okay. Try a different way. Uh, but I did come all the way down, so it just kind of feel like I, this should be it, but maybe it's not. I hate the Metroidvania thing of... Can I not progress because I'm missing something obvious, or can I not progress because I don't have the thing I need to progress? I'm just going to choo choose to assume it's the, for uh, the latter, and uh, try to figure out where to go. Tidrick, if, if 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 I'm flailing around like I'm right now, and you know what I'm supposed to do, please do tell me. Um, but like, not unsolicited, if that makes sense. But I'm I'm happy for hints and stuff. If I'm obviously stuck for where to go next, I'm gonna get back inside. Stand up here where the thing can't get me and hydrate. The room can be done right now. Okay, thank you. Also, welcome. Uh, as ever with games, with, with with games like this, or with games in general, to people who've played them before, uh, I apologise for the pain that I inflict upon your brain, eyes, and ears uh, with just how bad I am at video games in general. Just double checking I wasn't standing in the wrong place to uh, interact with it. I don't know if there's any terrain I couldn't see because of the textures. Uh, what's that? There we go. Hmm. Oh, hey, OBS, you did not like that. a thousand. I'd say 90% of people get here and then go back and they waste a thousand hours. No, that, that you know, makes total sense. Let's check I can't pull these out for what... I mean, this looks like I should be able to interact with it. Oh. Do not get the camera too close. That line does not like being straight. Take a, a loop of the room. See if there's anything I'm missing just by running blindly around on the walls, that kind of thing. Okay. okay. Okay, so I've got a door there. And then everything else is above me. I can't climb that I know of right now. I, can I get up there? Dang it. It's got a good looking PS1 game. It, you know, Jeff Quest, it, it, it holds up surprisingly well. I mean, to be fair, a lot of PS1 games hold up surprisingly well. Um, like, I'm, I, there, there's no up-res... I mean, there's the basic up emulation going on here, um, but I haven't messed with any of the settings in Duck Station. It is the game as... Yeah, the warping's not great, I will admit, but uh, that's, you know, an issue that we can't do anything about. Hmm... Really looks like a staircase. I 
<laughs> One of the charms of the PS1. What, the fact that no line is actually straight? Please, there we go. Again, to people who've seen this, you must be going crazy right now. This is emulated, you can actually fix the warping, but I prefer it. Yeah, well, the thing is, because I am... Um, I mean, my CPU is at 5% right now, so I probably could fix the warping via the emulator. But uh, I'd rather not risk breaking the stream. I like playing games as, the, as they were intended. Get on the thing, Raziel. Thank you. Hey, can I kill myself? That'll put me back in the spirit world, right? Where's fire? Is there a source of fire? I see that this is fine emote. Hey, can you kill me? Please? Please. Oh my. Thank you. No player is kind of like Zelda, right? But more badass and cool. Uh, that's my understanding, yeah. Or oh, yes, I should say. Okay, I can't open the door in this in the spirit realm, so maybe that's not the solution. Hey, I need health. Yeah, it's kind of like Zelda, but you devour the souls of your fallen enemies. Get back here. Take this one instead. There is lock on. It's uh, it's not great. It's also the sneak button. There you go. That's lock on. Anyway, it seems to be proximity based, which makes sense. Also makes sense that I can't open doors, I guess, well, as a spirit, so, um... That didn't work. It's good, otherwise it'd be wacky tobacco. Yeah, yeah it would. Or yes it would. I assume there's projectiles at some point as well, which you'd need lock on for. Okay, I'm back here. Death did not appear to be this. Well, death out there did not appear to be the solution. How far in am I? Well, I've been playing for about 54 minutes, but I suspect I'm not all that far in. Hey, if anyone wants to give me another clue, now's the time. I could look up a walkthrough. I have a non spoiler walkthrough uh, open for the collectibles. And every button does. So, square is attack, X is jump. Triangle does not appear to do anything right now. Circle is feed. That's sneak. That R1 sneak, L1 is crouch. The shoulders are the camera buttons. L3 and R3 don't appear to do anything. And then, select is, I assume, spells. Oh. Okay. Beware, Raziel. These wraiths are vampire spirits fettered too long in the spectral Thank realm. You. When their vampire natures adapt to this plane, they become eaters of souls. Do not allow these spirits to re inhabit their corpses. 
Oh yeah, right, Alter and Alter didn't exist on the PS1. You make a good point. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, I completely forgot that you didn't need the, um... The specific point to go back to the spirit realm. That's on me. I apologize. Oh no, don't make me do weird jumps. Yeah, I mean, if if I if I do something, if it's my fault, I'll apologize for it. I'm not too proud. I'm not too proud to admit that I can make mistakes. Okay, my voice will get back to you. It's okay. That's the dream. Right, before I uh, have to do all this again because I go into the wrong place, do I need to... What do you think, chat? Spirit Realm and this opens? Although I don't think that would be the case. As the one below wasn't open. It's over here. <laughs> and after it hits you with the game over. Game over, you suck. Anyway, uh, is this hiding anything? You know what? It wasn't. I didn't push it up as a shortcut back up. Otherwise, I would 100% do that. Or can I? Hang on. I, I feel like I'm going to be fighting the camera a lot during this. No, I cannot. I can only move it on this ledge. Ah, well, for the lols, let's put it over here. Slightly unintuitive, but uh, we'll, we'll go with it. Sure, why not? I've seen enough box-shaped holes in games to know what to do with a box when I see one. Oh, okay. I just <laughs> I was going to glide over the room, but sure, why not? The, uh, the whole shoving his hands into the box thing is kind of metal, and I'm here for it. I, I feel like gliding over the room, I may have missed something. Okay. I think I see it. I think I see what I have to do. Probably shouldn't try to pull it into the space I'm currently occupying. That would be a uh, that'd be a bad thing to do, right? Please. Will I be able to flip it onto that ledge? Not gonna lie. Huh. Maybe from this side. Not. 
Does it have to be on this ledge? Or do I have to push it all the way down and drag it all the way across? No, no, because I can't... Unless the game will let me push it off, pull it off certain ledges without other ones. One way to find out. Oh, that makes no sense. There's no consistency there. Right. Can I flip it up here now, or do I have to... I should probably save before doing that. Hey, if you could, like, stagger, thank you. They do not give you much soul. They do not give you much health back at all. I guess they are only minor vampires, right? I foresee a trip to the spirit realm in my near future. Rick, thank you so much for the follow. Uh, I apologise for any and all aneurysms you're ha you're actually experiencing watching this, and can only chalk it up to uh, being a sucker for punishment. But I really appreciate it. This is I uh, uh, I will be playing this tomorrow, hopefully with slightly more um, skill. Is that second emo? Ah, I see. Okay, uh, I thought I'd be able to flip it up. That is not the case. As you can plainly see. Uh, I just have a box in the hole. It's not question mark? Hmm. I apologize. Please, the box. was L1 to flip it, but nothing's happening. Yeah, I thought it was L1. Uh, I'm pressing L1, and it's not doing anything. All I'm pressing right now are L1 square and forwards. Is it? Is it a neutral input? Nope. I'm just pressing L1 and square, because if I let go square, let's go to the box. Hmm. Hold L1 and then square. I'll give it a go. Thank you. 
Oh, okay. L1 and then square. Okay. I thought I did it while I was uh, grabbing the box last time. Thank you. Could I have done it from the other side of the room? Just out of curiosity. Or do you have to take it all the way around? I didn't waste everyone's time then. Actually, there's there's an easy way to check. There, I can check this right now to see if I've just wasted like 10 minutes of everyone's lives. Slight exaggeration of time, perhaps. Uh, nope. That needs to be on this side of the, of the box, so I can actually put it in the space I was standing. So there should be enough room on the ledge right there. Yeah, you can't push it onto the half ledge for some reason. That's weird. That's a design choice. Right, I'm just going to assume I need the spiky sp the, the stick. So I'm going to take the stick. It's not... That's the room I was just stuck in. Isn't it? Pretty sure that's the room I was just stuck in. But it is the only place to go. <laughs> Puzzles! Exactly. Okay, well, I do need some health, so... Also gonna hydrate. Wow, you just leave that there, cool. Pit. Health. Thankful for the glide because I just walked off the edge like an idiot. Raziel hydrating is fine. Kane does not like hydration. Oh, well, Raziel's also a vampire. He's not a huge fan of hydration himself. He'll just take damage over time in the rain. I realized that never came up here in the uh, spirit realm, so... I was just curious what there was. Uh, the answer is absolutely nothing. I see the, the higher levels, I just don't know how to get to them. Well, in theory, that was never going to work. I'll admit. But I feel like the, that might be partly the solution. Oh dear. Oh hey, thanks geometry. The, um... The somewhat... The jump is a little aggressive for me. Oh dear. Can I just... Hang on, can I get to that from the ground? Do I have to go around all the time? Or can I jump to that ledge from here? Nope, I cannot. Okay. You know, I think this room might have been where I kept stopping as a child. Going back to the 
explanation that I played this as a child that no one will have heard because I deleted that mod. Because uh, nothing happened in it. Okay. So I've got two ledgers. Both seem equidistant. Let's go for this one. I'm just sneaking for the more precise controls. Can I, uh... Can I climb? No. Yeah, I don't know if I'm wrong with this, but my my assessment of this room is you do the entire room puzzle just so that you can go back into the other room in the uh, spirit world. So you can climb up to the top to get over here. But I could be wrong about that. just don't see how you get up here in the material world. But then I don't know where you go from here because you can't make the jump. Don't seem to be able to climb this. Can I cut it? Nope. Hmm. Just not high enough. Oh well, it's a, it's a good way to get used to the controls, I suppose. Oh, I say that, walking off an edge. I'm assuming I can't make the glide from here to the next rafter. I have absolutely nothing to lose by testing this theory out, I suppose. I'm just gonna go over here so I, I don't end up in the, um, in the pit and land on the ledge on the side. No. Okay, so that's not working. You get about halfway and then lose the height. Which is how a glide works, funnily enough. Okay, so... Take stock of my new position. I assume that's my end goal. That's how you solve the puzzle to open the door. Probably doesn't help. Oh, hang on. Am I... I'm making assumptions right now. And you should never make assumptions. No, those are still most definitely still... It. I'm just curious, I'm going to save before doing this, just in case the worst happens. I'm assuming that the ge the level's just, the, the, the geometry, the collision is just going to push me out of this box. Yeah. 
I lost health doing that. So that's cool. Oh dear, I forgot to crouch first. That's on me. still it opened the get this gate but that was all it seemed to do music stop in this game music was also top in uh, blood omen i uh, really really enjoyed the music of blood omen too oh dear i bonked bonking is bad much like swooping I apologize for anyone who's like, it's so easy, do this, you idiot. Uh, I am an idiot, but I try to be a cheerful idiot. Hey, Razio, when I press X, do you think you could uh, do the thing, please? I think I pressed X too soon after pressing L1. Or too, so too close to the edge, which is more likely. Oh, do you, do you regen health in the spirit world? Would be pretty neat if you did. There we go. Do we all get stuck in video games? That's true. I'm also having to remind myself that this came out in, what, 1996? Back when puzzle design was, uh... obtuse, to say the least. He said, hey, Razi, I'll automatically look to the cat. The cat is named after this character. That is a fantastic name for a cat. I will be honest. Like, I never got this far as a kid, I don't think. But, um, you know, what with being like 22 years between now and the last time I probably played this game. Uh, I did kind of, as a child, want to rename myself Raziel because it's such a cool name. And I wouldn't even have to change my initial. It's the same freaking initial. That's the cool thing. These have to be here for a reason. Can't use that because I'm in the spirit world. That was close. Thank you, Coyote time. Uh, hmm. If anyone has a hint they can give me, now is the time. I would be very appreciative. Having just admitted that I wanted to name myself after the main character of a game, that I never got past the first, you know, section of. In Spirit World, everything is immovable. Check it out. Uh... Again, I'm making assumptions. Everything's immovable apart from things that move in the spirit world. Okay. Assumption one tested. Can't test assumption two without being in the spirit world. Gosh dang it. Uh, I guess here works. You know what? I'll move this. I might need this. Who knows? Hello. Hang 
Well, I'm down here, actually. I realised I didn't... Do any of the elevations of objects change between the material and the spirit realm? Well, I know the these change between the two realms. And also, I'm assuming the, um... Oh, hang on. Maybe? Again, I'm making assumptions. And that's the first... That... I... I, I... Really? Assumptions are the, uh... The worst things to make when trying to solve puzzles. Where's... Where are those lamps? Or whatever they are. Okay, they don't move. Dang it! I thought that might be it. Oh! That's why you can't get the box up here, because I bet you could jump from the box onto the ledge or whatever it is. Speaking of boxes, I'm in the wrong world again. Dang it. Can I get that box down here? Doing the right thing before, just in the wrong world. I don't know how to get up there in this world. Except I do, because there's a portal here, you idiot. Hey, I'm a fool! I'm also impatient right now. There's no soul close enough, is there? Be right back, going for a soul. For some reason, it just doesn't click that... I mean, obviously, things do change, because I've benefited from things changing to get up here, but... It just didn't click that other things might change, I'll be honest. Uh, I can just make the jump. Nope. Okay. Every player eventually has to reconcile the fact that the material realm and the spirit realm are similar, but not the same. Yep. And I, when I, when I read about this mechanic, I was like, that is 100%. Well, I wasn't like anything. I actually was. That's 100% going to be my downfall. It's just making assumptions that things stay the same between them. Because I'm more used to the idea that uh, things will be, uh, like, the level itself will be slightly different. Not that... Um, things in one realm will oh dear, will affect things in the other if you, if you know what I mean if that makes sense I don't know if I'm explaining myself particularly clearly I'm very flustered the stream was cursed to begin with but it seems to be going better now and hopefully you all you all are enjoying yourselves I should also just save the game also it occurs to me I'm emulating this and I could just save state on this ledge and save us all a whole lot of hassle But, as with many things in life, you need others to challenge your preconceived notions. So chat, thank you for challenging my preconceived notions. I didn't fall off, you can't prove anything.
I also promise not to abuse safe states. Uh, just as a nope. just a matter of course. Probably should safe state because the loading system in this game is quite harsh. Well, um, the emulator safe, uh, states when on quit out, but I will almost I will take that under advisement. And uh, that's not a box, you idiot. Um, did I just do it? Okay, I'll uh, I'll, uh, I'll save state before I quit as well. Okay. Uh, anything useful up here? Not immediately obvious if there is. Well, it's not immediately obvious if there is. I'll run around for a bit longer like this, seeing if I missed anything, and then, you know, realize that I shouldn't have turned back so soon and do the spell of shame. Safe states on some of the puzzles are simply a quality of life improvement given platforming and realm switching involved. Yeah, I, uh. Imagine for a second if I wanted to push a box instead of pick up a torch. How revolutionary would that be? Raziel, I appreciate your uh, telekinetic ability, but please don't. Right, how do I... Just be me, but I was like the sound Razio grabs a box. Oh no, it's a very satisfying noise. You proud of me, chat? I solved the puzzle without your help. Look at that. There might even be one wrinkle in my brain. There is also never a question if it's grabbed or not. I suppose that's you know I'll also maintain I'll maintain two safe states and swap between them. Um, that's the benefit of having the interact button on the uh, attack button because you know which one you've done. These five wrinkles in oh no instead of us it it smoothens out after this after each stream is done. I did writing yesterday for Ko-Fi reasons and um, you know, 5e writing and uh, I accidentally invented my own take on uh, Yarnum. So that was great. Having never played Bloodborne, I just know some of the lore and I'm obsessed with the aesthetic. Such a cool aesthetic. Oh, oh I'm back here. Hopefully this works. Oh god, no. Yeah, so I, uh, I was writing samples for commissions because um, I truly believe if someone's going to commission me, they need to be able to, need to know what I'm capable of writing. Um, I was like, I'm just going to 
I'm not going to use my normal setting. I'm going to make a start afresh. And we'll, we're going to um, you know, make a new setting that I haven't used before. Uh, expand my creative horizon so I'm not just writing my own setting constantly. And it uh, apparently I just wanted to write gothic rainy horror. It's cool though. I'm proud of what I wrote. It was a. Uh, I think it's a good showcase of my skills as as of this moment. This is an interesting fact. This game was in was incredibly ambitious, and the content intended for this game was used to fill the game. And the next game is still not entirely used. Oof. The next game is in this very room chat. And also in my Steam library. I should point that one out too, thanks on Sabadeus. But I figured I may as well start with the first game in the series. Not chronologically, of course, because the timeline's weird. But in terms of release. Of Turin. Is you closing on Melkaya? Sweet boss fight. You know what? Yeah, Blood Omen is 1,000 years previous. Well, more than 1,000 years previously. I assume the middle of the room is also a good place to go. I to do so much with this game, it would have been amazing to see what they were doing at the time. Isn't that the case with a lot of these, um... That's a drill. With a lot of these older games, though, their ambition kind of outstripped the, uh... what they could achieve. Does this do anything now? Sure does. So until the remake, we should be so lucky. Still true to this day. I do. I. I will admit that I really, really like it when um, devs make ambitious games. And like, they might not necessarily achieve what they wanted to achieve, but you can tell the the passion and the heart is there. So especially through the series, the technology couldn't keep up with the law. It's good law. Okay, I feel like I need to put something in there. I can't turn it off. Hey, yo, crossbow. I think this is just, just backtracking, right? I think it's just one big loop. Yeah, because that's where I came in, and then I went to the right. Unless I do need to backtrack further. Hey, you don't have a crossbow. I prefer you. Okay, so. Is there any advantage to swapping between realms? I mean, I could get health back, I suppose. That might be useful. This isn't doing anything. Oh, yeah. You know what? Heck it. Why not? Be happy to see Raziel and Kane 
and the Elder God much higher polygon count. Well, there's the uh, HD remaster, obviously, for the... Um... Dreamcast, uh... ROM. That gives you Raziel and Kane, and I assume the question mark, question mark, question mark character in a higher polygon count, because that was the, uh... Apparently, apparently the Dreamcast version had higher polygon count on the models, but lower resolution on the textures. And if I had realised that the HD version ran on the Dreamcast version, I may have considered it before putting so much time and effort into getting this PlayStation version to work. But here we are. Also, I'm always wary about doing um, HD things just because I'd rather have the stream uh, run smoothly because I do everything on one, on one computer. Okay, in answer to my question, there does not appear to be any benefit to being in this room. Dreamcast was originally the target platform. Makes sense. Also, of course, I have a PlayStation controller. I don't have a spare Dreamcast controller lying around. I don't know why I did that. I know things don't move in this realm. It's something like... SR1-remaster.com or something like that, I think. I was looking at it while I was uh, fixing this. A lot of work has gone into it. It is, it is very clear to see that much. Okay, so I'm, I'm starting to think the answer to my problems may not be in this room at all. Oh, yeah, sorry, if you're not... Uh, a VIP or a mod, you, you can't face the link. I might have the tab open still, actually. Uh, I do not have the tab, op tab open still. I apologize. I can just grab the link really quickly, though. SoulReaverHDRemaster.com Yeah, just before I got there. I mean, it, like I say, it, it it does look really cool. Um, I'm just super cautious about doing stuff. Uh, that will, may impact the stream quality, and I didn't have time to test anything. Um, earlier. Also, I really truly thought it was for the PC version until uh, about two hours ago when I realized it was not. Hey chat, uh, is the thing I need in this room? I have no shame. Okay, cool. Good to know. Oh, hey, a bot! It would happen as I, uh... Goodbye, bot. It would happen as I pass through a door and have to peace out. What you get for looking at the remaster site right now. It's all good. I just want the hammer. I assume I have to lower this somehow. Okay, that's clearly that. Oh, is this a boss arena? It's got fire and it's got two weapons in it. 
That's a very positive sign. That was a bold decision to make it so that you can't turn the camera 360 when you're doing this. Uh, not quite for like second person view, I guess. I guess technically third person is just over the head rather than over the shoulder. Just seeing if there's anything in this room in this uh, view. Answer that question is no. So, does Raziel lose health constantly in the physical realm, or am I just glancing at the uh, the health meter at the wrong time? I was just curious if, then, if there was anything back here. I think it does appear slowly. Because I keep glancing at it and I'm like, it looks like it's gone down, but I can't tell. And the last time I checked for that kind of thing in, in earnest, it was raining. So I wasn't sure if it was the rain doing it or if it was, you know, being in the material plane physical realm. Okay, chat. I'm an idiot. Don't mind me. Where's my spiky thing? I wish to impale myself. Uh, I think it was over here somewhere. Oops. Oh, cool. The rain does have an effect, too. Yeah, because I'm not at full health anymore, so it must be a thing. Yeah, don't mind me, chat. I, uh, I, I, I noticed that my first run through the room and paid it absolutely no mind. I was like, oh, that's a cool thing. Okay. Immediately forget about it. Okay. How do you just drop? Assume for a moment that I don't want to yeet things into walls constantly. How do I... Can I just drop things? I mean, that kind of worked, I guess. Stay there, staff. You <laughs> saw so yoink, there is no drop. Apparently so. Oh, do I then have to push that the entire way into that other, into the drill? I remember doing this, I remember finding it tough at first. Yeah, I'm getting those vibes. Oh, is this a... Pressing all of the buttons. Why are you not? Okay, did it not go far enough? I'm pretty sure it's as far as I can get it. Fool. Don't push it. Pull it. Yeah, I can't move it any further. I, I mean, I can push it back in. Okay. I like how, uh... Oh, 
mind. I like how Raziel's telekinesis has never ex hasn't been explained yet. Not that the game needs defense. But this room Tomb Raider also had some. Oh, I yeah, I've played a lot. A deep, let's say a chunk of the original Tomb Raider, and I did not enjoy the puzzles in that. That looks like a pullable texture. So if I drop this down here somewhere. Can I grab this? A mistake may have been made. Texture seems to imply I can move it further. Razil's strong, but family's stronger. Uh, I assume Legend Killer? Uh, or Sevenge Killer? Uh, I'm not playing a Fast and the Furious game though, so it's not about the family. Although, you know, it is. K Kane very much puts himself as a father figure for Vampire Kind, I suspect. He just seems to be that kind of person. But yeah, Raziel is pretty strong. I like, I like how the music is a general low le low level sense of uh, something's gonna happen, something's gonna happen, something's happening, uh, and nothing is actually happening. I'm just walking around solving puzzles. Wow, they were committed to this mechanic, weren't they? You know what? As my musical interludes go, that one wasn't too bad. got telekinesis. Use it. A <laughs> dysfunctional family is still a family. Can confirm whether or not you want it to be. It still is. with me. Uh, where do these want to go? I'm running out of time as well, so... This will be a learning experience. Watching this at least confirms that I was pretty clever at some point in my life. Uh, I mean, you've made your way to my channel, and I'm 
reasonably sure you were a follower, so you, you, you have to be pretty smart. Or the alternative is you are absolutely not, because you're here. But yeah, if you solve if you solve this puzzle, your brain has at least two wrinkles, let's say. Fun fact about brain wrinkles. <laughs> oh. I made a clicking sound. Interesting. Uh, I don't know where I was going with that. I, w I was trying to segue into ko oh, koalas are so stupid they can't recognize eucalyptus. Which is all they eat uh, if it's on a plate and not the tree. Clever than I still can't find the unsubscribe button. It's there, I believe. I believe you'll find it someday. This just seems like wholly impractical architecture, if I'm being honest. Imagine if you had to do this every day to get to the, I don't know, the bathroom. Right, now my stick's over there. Can I choose this? Sure can. Let's go down this wall. Go down this hole. Oh, this is the way up. Never mind. Actually, do I want to go up? Hmm. Because this takes me down, takes me to the gate that was closed. Now it's open. Vampires don't have to worry about going to the bathroom and they have plenty of time to design up choose irrational puzzle rooms. It's true. They really do. I still don't trust that room above with the weapons on the wall and the random bonfire. All oh, the red fog. Maybe figure out this bot out quicker than I did. Oh joy. I assume all these bosses have puzzles. Show yourself, creature. Do you not recognize me, brother? Am I so changed? Uh yes. No Kaya? Yes, brother. You should have stayed where the master sent you, Raziel. You will find Nosgoth less pleasant than you remember. What has become of my clan? Answer me, little brother, or I will beat an answer from your horrid lips. Everyone is afraid, sibling. You awake to a world of fear. These times of change are so unsettling. Do you think I feel no revulsion for this form? Do you believe for a moment that our Lord would risk his empire upon an upstart inheritance? Enough riddles. What are you saying? You are the last to die. Okay, I'm assuming there's a gimmick. I like how there's, uh... There's no question of how Raziel is back. It is simply, everything is terrible, now die.
Okay, I can get in the cage. I don't know why I want to be in the when it comes to death, Razo is both the Alpha and the Omega. Well, he has been there and done that. Cast a spell. Cast a spell again. Can I hit you? Are you vulnerable during that period? My next option, my next idea is uh, Spirit Realm. But I noticed weird things happened when he cast a spell, so. anyways. Okay. The cage, I see he can walk through. So I get back out. As my agent, you are beyond death, Raziel. Your enemies cannot destroy you. If you grow too weak, however, you will always be drawn here to recover. No. Beyond the ruins of your former stronghold and above the gardens of the dead, your brother Melkiah waits. It's like the, hey, this is the, the the hint system about where to go next. Hey, where'd that portal go? Never mind. I reasoned it was faster to just run, to, to just do this, than fast travel and walk back. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't skip it. Show yourself, creature. I'll save state after this. Do you not recognize yeah, I'll save state me, after brother? Am I so changed? Oh, gotta check this text message while I'm waiting. Melkaya? Yes, brother. You should have stayed where the master sent you, Raziel. You will find Nosgoth less pleasant than you remember. What has become of my clan? Answer me, little brother, or I will beat an answer from your horrid lips. Everyone is afraid, sibling. You awake to a world of fear. These times of change are so unsettling. I really do like Malkai's you think design. I feel no great. revulsion for this form. Do you believe for a moment that our Lord would risk his empire upon an upstart inheritance? 
Also, very reminiscent Enough of the riddles. next game on the schedule. What are you saying? You are the last to die. Dead Space is the next game. Specifically, Dead Space on easy, so that I can play the entire game with the plasma cutter. Oh, it's the green thing when he phases through. Absolutely is. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna get the ability to walk through fences. Stuff one at first because the way forward is not made obvious. Or well, this fight? Oh, I can. <laughs> I totally get it. I don't think this is doing anything. not doing anything and when he's phasing hang on was that something up there when he's phasing through the the, the grate the, 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 the fence the cage whatever wasn't doing anything with weapon or ability to consume souls oh hang on so uh, what was that whole thing with the drill about that I did Answer that question. I need health back, so I'm just gonna do this. Oh dear. Yes, excellent. Oh, they're trapped. Wonderful. I guess I just walk around and wait for my health to come back. Hey, can you get me up here? Oh, I see. I think I see. Get him in the cage, pull the lever, the thing drops. Oh, uh, the answer to the question, by the way, is he absolutely cannot get me up here. I'm just waiting for my health to regenerate. I'm good. Yeah, well, don't say that. I've got to pull it off first. Run, Raziel, run! Please. Grab the thing. Okay. I'm also not entirely... Oh, is it? Is it like flipping a cube? Is it L1 first? Otherwise you just kind of grab and hang on. Get in the cage, brother. I will be honest, when I turned the drill on, I wasn't entirely sure what I pressed. I know Square was involved. Hopefully this is a one and done, after I figure out how to do it. Okay, he's in the cage. I see. Hey, do you want to get in the cage again? There we go. Nope. I don't know why I jumped. Oh, 
Oh. That was close. Kind of need to go is the issue I'm having. I have some stuff I need to do this evening. But at the same time, if I've, like, I, I feel like I've figured out the gimmick, I just need to, uh, you know, do it. Brother, get in the dang cage. What did I ever do to you, game? I think I have to go and regenerate again in the moment. Although I guess while I'm standing up there, I could save state. He's in the cage. I just don't know how to drop the cage. Oh, that's right, I'm up. Well, you can't get me, sucker. I apologize for that chat, wholeheartedly. No, it. Well, I didn't even save state while I was up there. That's on me. Although I suppose technically I don't need to. Should have full health by the time I do another run around. Okay, I genuinely don't know if I'm doing this wrong. I, well, I genuinely don't know if I'm supposed to press something else other than square to do the winch, or if I just have to time it perfectly. Like I said, I, I don't know how I did it last time. I just did it. And I assumed that it was just because I pressed square in the right place. It is literally just a case of he has to be in there before Raziel does anything. I can't jump over that for some reason. Interesting. Nom 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 nom. But with no lower jaw. Oh my dude, come in! Please! 
enjoy the cage. Ah, he's come out of it again. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna consult the internet to see if I'm doing something wrong or if I'm just mistiming it. I'm doing something wrong. Never mind. Oh uh, yeah, I hadn't noticed that you can jump over these gates. Somehow, apparently. I don't know. Yeah. I didn't notice this was a hole. I thought it was just um, like a banner on the wall. Hey, my, see, because of the red fog, I thought it was a texture, not a hole in the wall. Uh, that's on me. How does that benefit me in the slightest? Dude walks through the gate. It just looks like a red wall hanging. I'm, I am so sorry, chat. That must have been truly annoying to watch. Hang on. I think I know. Yeah, it's just the timing. Okay. Don't just spam it, time it. Yeah, because I'd seen the red, but, you know. I hadn't realized it was a hole. I do like the, uh, the phasing effect. That's pretty cool. Can I just hold square? I sure can. Well, that's mildly annoying. I apologize. That is nowhere near as hard as I was making it out to be. Tell me, Melkaia, where can I find Cain? The master is beyond your reach, Raziel. He makes himself known when he sees fit, not when commanded. Bye. somehow talking without a body as well. It's impressive. Kind of tough when I did where I did no one spoil No, I appreciate people not wanting to spoil it for me. Thank you. You have done well, Raziel. Am I reduced to this? A ghoul? A fratricide. Elevated, Raziel, not reduced. 
consuming Melchia's soul has endowed you with a new gift. Insubstantial barriers such as these are no impediment to you in the Spectral Realm. Will yourself to pass through, and you shall. Okay, so you do have to be in the Spectral Realm to go through barriers. Good to know. Pressing up. Uh. Oh, there's a delay. Cool. It's actually a, a, a decent place to reach because the first, I think, five health upgrades, you need the phase ability to actually unlock. Look at that box. I wish to stand upon it. say i need to head off so thank you all for watching i'll be back tomorrow with more of this um tomorrow's friday yes tomorrow's friday uh with more of this we'll start with collecting health upgrades and then take it from from there uh but if you're not following the channel please do if you've enjoyed or see potential for enjoyment um and hopefully I see you tomorrow. But until I see you next time, please do stay safe. Please do stay healthy. Please do stay wholesome. And uh, much love to you all. To you all. Goodbye.